They said they're going to do everything in their power to make sure you stay the way you are, whether it's wacky, whether it's drugged out, whether it's loud, whether it's, I don't know, whatever it is, right? They're going to they're gonna enable you for it. And it used to be annoying me a lot, especially someone like a Burt Kreiser. I remember recently, he made a comment like, oh, I think he was talking to, I think it's his recent one with, um, uh, what's their name? It's a recent one now with, with uh, Liza Kosher, Kosher, whatever. Anyway, it doesn't, Natasha Leggero and something Kosher, her husband, right? Two big comedians too. He's talking to the podcast. He's like, oh my God, like this thing I always do, I break all the toilets all the time. I always break toilets. I always break toilets. He's like, why? Because I sit heavy. That's what I do. I always sit heavy and stuff. I'm like, why do you sit heavy? Like, why don't you just like sit slowly? It's like, you know, got people in the office who like, in my office or I've got others I work to who do that heavy foot thing like on purpose, right? It's like, look, walk slower. Like, I don't know, like soften your feet. I grew up in a house where all those little kooks and kirks that you had that you thought made you interesting, they got beaten out of you, right? They got flipping shouting at you across the road. Like, I got Steve now. Stop walking so heavy on the stairs. Okay, mom. I mean, like, you just like, you just, any kook you had got like ripped out of you. But in general, I think because of my whole self-help run that I had a few years ago, I think there are things in your life that you should be ch- able to change, right? In order to kind of make your life better or to make the experience of living better or to maybe, I don't know, just to uh, allow you to do the things that you want to do. So I see someone like a Burt Crash saying, oh, I sit heavy on, I sit heavy on everything. I'm the one that just like, I let gravity, because I think he was mentioning a story where he said that he thinks he nearly killed his child one day when they were camping because he literally missed the, the, the head of his child by an inch because he just always sits down without looking and spamming his bum on the floor. It's like, that isn't a good, that isn't a cool thing to have. That's not like an interesting kooky trait. That's just like recklessness and irresponsibility and just like not knowing the surroundings you're in. You know I mean, so if you're in your own house and you just want to sit in your city, cool. But if you go to your friend's house and you're, you know, jumping on the city, I'm going to be a bit annoyed, right? That's not the way to kind of carry yourself. But again, I've noticed that there are things that I pick and choose that I want to change and things that I don't want to change. I think probably Burt Crash would argue the same sort of things, right? And all the things he should change in his life, maybe he's sitting, he- sitting really heavily on things isn't the what number one priority. Same with myself, right? Maybe my inability to not have friends isn't maybe the highest thing that I should be kind of reaching for to kind of change because maybe that's kind of what's allowed me to be um, at the position I am in now to pursue the things I'm pursuing outside of it because I don't necessarily have the structures that everyone else has, right? On the Thursday or Friday or people calling you and telling you to go out here and there. Like if I go out, I'm just literally going out to meet one person or two people, right? That are in my life for the most part, right? Um, that's it. And the other times we're going out, I'm going out to, to go out for my own kind of pleasure, right? Um, whether it's going out to go mix garage, to go to fold, to go to X or Y O, to go to these venues. I'm literally going on my own to go to pie and have a good time by myself. I don't, I don't really care about anyone else that's there for the most part. So that again is a kook that I have. You know, it is what it is. You get older and you realize, you know what? I'll pick and choose my battles. I'm going to pick and choose them. Um,